Welcome back to Sailor Max Save the World. Finally, got the vodka. Now there's truth to him. There's a fight. There's a squeak. Uh, so hot. Yeah. Who's the one? Go ahead. Like me. Where are we going, Sam? We're off to the White House. Oh boy! Not the whole thing. Still technically two uh, Telltales episodes. episodes left. Welcome back, Governor. Wizard, here to give another demonstration on soda abuse? That's not funny! Would you like a drink? As long as it's not soda! Stay dry, Wizman. Stay. Vodka. Here for a drink? It's soda, right? You brought more soda! Sure, why not? That's got more kick than the other ones. Thanks, Seven Match. You guys, you guys are my best friends. Now can we get back to the deliberation? What's the point? You still think Beeper's idea is stupid. Stupid? You never told me you thought my <laughs> idea was stupid. He said your idea of adding Herbert Hoover hugging the four other presidents was the Stupidest thing he'd ever heard! Well, it is! Hoover wasn't even a president, which means he certainly wasn't the most loving of all the presidents. Well, at least I didn't suggest putting a parking garage in George Washington's forehead, like some four eyed freaks I know. You little. You big. Of course you realize. This means war! 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 What wondrous thing is this the death con Claxon's ring? A flashing light above the door, there's just one thing it could be.
Well, let's not do that again. So. The civil war in the Dakotas seems to be escalating, Max. Let them thin out the overpopulation of moose and strip malls for a few weeks, and then we'll step in. Hmm. Look, Max, in the White House garden pond, it's Jimmy Two Teeth. We often allow lobbyists to use the pool, Sam. Jimmy's a lobbyist now? What's he lobbying for? Cheese interests? Affordable health care for the aged and underprivileged, Sam. He's a lot more multifaceted than you give him credit for. It looks like Bismarck has fallen to the West Dakota militia. Oh no! That will wipe out the country's crucial snow and slush preserves! Your compassion for your people is heartwarming, Mr. President. It's a plate of fancy cookies. For the discriminating general with a sweet tooth and a taste for vengeance. <laughs> hey, there's gourmet coffee. In case the idea of war makes you insufficiently jittery. I'm plenty juice just being in here. Let's blow stuff up. These must be for the Joint Chiefs and other quasi-important hoo-hahs. Nice screensaver! Let's use the President's computer. That's where all the good stuff is. <laughs> what to do in time of war? Select target, press fire. That's all it says. Looks like a remote homing beacon in the frigid Antarctic. So peaceful. So serene. Wanna blow it up? You have to ask? <laughs> Dinner special tonight? Penguin flambe! Who would have suspected the Washington Monument is really a self-replenishing supply of intercontinental ballistic missiles? <laughs> it's hard to see it used for something more useful than corny innuendo for once. I wonder if this will have a significant impact on our delicate ecosystem. Absolutely. My ego is bigger already. The homing beacon to the Kremlin doesn't seem to be working. It was probably turned off in the spirit of Glasnost. More likely those lazy commie bastards forgot to change the batteries. Lazy former commie bastards, Max. It's the distant, peaceful world of Krypton. They mock us with their utopian society of crystal cities and absentee parents. They must be exterminated! This'll teach him to put me in the Phantom Zone. You will bow down before me! Aww. Better pull up a chair, little buddy. Well, what do you know? Bosco was right. The government really has been targeting his store for destruction. Won't he be glad when we tell him? What do you say we keep this to ourselves, Max? You're right! We don't want to ruin the surprise! <laughs> We've already got a missile on the way there. Attention, Bosco shoppers! Clean up in aisle everything! Hmm. Sorry, Bosco. Would you look at that? Bosco's satellite defense system actually works. Well played, Bosco. You're safe. 
But for how long? There's no beacon for the missile to lock onto. Then we'll just have to do this the slow way. Lock and load, Sam! We're off to Red Square! Some other time, little buddy. <laughs> this is just a senseless waste of taxpayer dollars. But it's undeniably fun, Sam! Well, I just... I guess we speak with Bob. Where are we going, Sam? Back to the office. Shotgun! Hey, Bosco. Ah! Tell us about that missile defense system again. I'm working on modifying BTAS Pot D. Once I get funding for it, it'll be able to shoot down any ICBMs targeted at the store. See you later, Bosco. Hmm. There. Where are we going, Sam? After that rampaging Lincoln. Yes!
arm that is seem working. This is just a senseless waste of taxpayer dollars. But it's undeniably fun, Sam! Where are we going, Sam? Back to the office. Shotgun! Look, stuck to the camera. That must be the homing beacon for the intercontinental ballistic missiles aimed at Bosco's store. What was that? Uh, he said, that must be the best price on baby wipes I've ever seen. <laughs> now we have our limitations and judgment. Let's get that beacon attached to giant Lincoln. Where are we going, Sam? After that rampaging Lincoln. Yes! Yeah. 
Looks like the targeting beacon is still stuck on Lincoln. This is a pretty impressive temper tantrum, Sam. At this rate, you'll have enslaved all of D.C. and most of Baltimore by tomorrow morning. He can't. You're right, Max. Still, I think we should stop him. We haven't got anything better to do. <laughs> Mr. President? Don't mind if I do. Wait, <laughs> let's go. Shouldn't we revel a little? We don't want to miss this. <laughs> We broke two presidents in one afternoon. A personal best! Well, <laughs> it looks like the country is saved. At least for mass hypnosis. What do you want to do now? Let's abuse my powers as leader of the free world to squeeze the middle class until they're burning their own shoes for heat! Sounds fun, but I was thinking we could treat ourselves to some chocolate frosted gut bombs and then have a little target practice down to the Smithsonian. Sam, you're my best friend. Agent Chuckles, report. Query status. Lincoln Gamble, four score, stroke seven. Query not acknowledged in acceptable timeout parameters. Error. 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 See you next time.